River rats, I got my worms. I'm at this poopy little uh, dried up spillway thingy and I'm here to do my best uh, Josh impersonation. But the difference is I'm, I'm down here to catch bait. All right, let's go. So the spillway is not really spilling, which means we're probably not gonna catch anything crazy, but I did see some uh, sunfish and bluegills swimming around. So I will take those. I just need to catch a lot of them. So I use a lot of bait. And if they're not here, we're gonna go try somewhere else. Uh, there's a few less weeds over there. We'll toss it over there. Hopefully they're thick in here and hungry. Generally, if I don't get a bite in five seconds when I'm bait fishing, I get a little antsy. Uh, I see something coming. Oh yeah. Come on guys, poor ice shades are sweet when it comes to doing stuff like this. Or it really sucks because you can see the fish and they're not eating. There's literally one staring at my night crawler right now. He's not real big though. Oh, come on. Oh yep, there he is. Eat it, eat it. Yeah, he just sampled it. <sighs> That look more like a bluegill than a green sunfish, which I'll take the bluegills too, but given the option, green sunfish all day. Oh, he's attacking it. I think that is my green sunfish, but he's about that big. 100% green sunfish. Where's the big ones? They might not be here. Saw some bigger ones as I was walking down. I'm gonna slide over there. Well, let's make one cast across the way just to see what happens. Immediately hit by something small. He clean me. Oh, those dirty dogs. And suddenly I am night crawlerless. But that's why I brought more. Let's uh, try a different spot. Ooh, that's something more substantial, but he bolted. Are you a gill? Let's set her down deeper. Somebody's just attacking it voraciously. Come on, I can't leave here without, oh, there was one, without catching one. I mean, I technically could, but I don't want to. There's some decent sized ones in there. It's just the little guys are the only ones hitting it. It's problematic. And he's just going ham on it. There ain't much nightcrawler left now on this one either. Just itty bitty green sunfish. Oh, I see one there. Oh, I got one. Hey! Almost not even worth keeping. But we're going to keep him. On the board with this monster. <laughs> Need to put water in my bucket. Oh, that's poison ivy. Good. And where I'm at, you can't travel with water from one body of water to another. So I just use this until I get to my truck where I got a, a cooler with water in it. And I don't feel like walking down there to fill my bucket up, so I'm just gonna lower it. Fill up bucket. Take your time. It's gonna have plenty of water in it. Yep. Okay. Bluegill bud's still cool. Come on the outside of the mouth. Not totally uncommon with the little guys. Be sweet if something really cool showed up. Like bullheads. Bullheads would be pretty sweet. Clear as the water is, you'd think you'd see them swimming around. 
All the commotion must have spooked them off. All right, no time for patience when it comes to catching bait. Sliding, sliding down the, back down the bank. Okay, maybe here. Try to be somewhat stealthy. Cause I saw them swimming and they spooked immediately earlier. It's a bluegill looking thing. Tiny. Oh, big gill. He is spooky as all get out though. I think this place gets fished a little bit. Oh, had one. All right, I've seen enough of this place. Let's keep moving. Mm, try by that bridge. Well, there's a little current here. Which isn't a bad thing, usually. I think I'll even toss one on the bottom right here. Maybe there's a few bullheads down there. I do not know. It's actually kind of deep. Not the best sign for bullheads. We'll see what happens. Oh, immediate. Sweet. Sunfish hybrid. How's it going? Good. Good. That's not all bad. No. Have a great day. You too. Oh, they're down there. Sweet. This spot ain't so bad. Ooh, that's a greenie right there. Oh, he swiped at it and didn't finish it. You're plenty big enough. Took my bait. What a guy. Jeez. Took it again. If we're gonna be honest, I prefer the red worms for sunfish for this reason. They're a lot tougher. But I don't have a place that sells red worms close to me right now, so this is what we got. Those are green sunfish. They're about to get a cast net thrown on them. Can't do it with bluegills, but you can do that with sunfish. Maybe there's some under the bridge? I'm gonna bet there is. Yep, it'll work. Another little hybrid bud. They're so pretty. Flatheads think so too. Yeah, I think I see some more over here. Might have just been my imagination. We oh, got a nib. I think. Yeah, these little guys are just gonna keep robbing me. Definitely going to the other side. Okay, moving. Hmm. Oh, there's some sunfish and bluegills. Eat it. They're chasing it hard. It came from everywhere. He liked it, didn't love it. It's got to be a green sunfish by that concrete. I mean, if there's hybrids, there's got to be green sunfish in here. Try under here. Yeah. It's not the most comfy place to fish, but nope. You catch them, that's all that matters. Oh, I did get bit and got my bait stolen immediately. <sighs> Try this again. <clears throat> Just hanging out with the spiders. 
put the top chunk on. It's a little sturdier. Guess I'm also hanging out with the swallows. And a nibble. Got a set too deep. There we go. Now can I get a nibble? Or better yet, like a full-blown bite. Oh, there's a nibble. Full-blown bite. Got something. <laughs> Flathead gold. Not quite, but pretty decent. Definitely taking them. Only need like four more dozen. If we're being honest, the shade's nice. I'm trying not to look up because I'm scared there's a tarantula crawling on my head or something. Oh, there's something. It's a piece of grass. False alarm. Ooh. Eat it. Oh, he darted away right at the end. Yeah, that bluegill came in, guns a-blazing. Oh. Oh, I whiffed him. He took most of my bait. I'd say I don't think my fishing rod is the most ideal for in here, but I don't know what would be the most ideal. Okay, try this again. Try to get closer to that stump. I don't think you can get much closer to that stump. Well, my camera battery died, so I decided it was time for lunch break, and it was delicious. We got time for one more spot, and I'm, you know, hoping this is the juice. You gotta walk a little ways. I am so stuffed. It's kind of awesome. This looks very green sunfishy. Some other dude fishing, so that's a good sign. Maybe even bullheads in a place like this. What is that? Oh, it's gunk. Can't tell if that's stuff swimming. I don't know. Cast and find out. Hopefully the old worms are still doing good. Well, they've been better. Oh, that's quick. A bunch of little guys in here, apparently. Instant bites, though. No idea what they are. I'd love to find out. Definitely not a bullhead. A bullhead would have been pooping it out by the time I set the hook. Nope. Whiff. Might be walking to the dam here in a sec. Weeds don't extend out quite as far. Wind would be less of an issue. Yep. Okay. Oh, sorry for disturbing you, Mr. Frog. Ooh, there was something stumbling around, spooking everything. Let's see if I can put it in the pocket. Something nibbling on it. Oh, I got him. I actually got him. And he ain't bad. That'll do. Always hoping for green sunfish, but that's not a bad gill. In the bucket. I got him too. He'll do. He'll do just fine. Kinda is the hot pocket. No, that wasn't where I wanted it. Immediate. Oh, missed him. Tough to have it all. What's gonna happen is I'm probably gonna hook like a five pound largemouth in here. Oh, oh, he was dark. I thought he was a green sunfish. Got excited. Still going in the bucket.
man, instant. That's what I'm talking about. Five in a row. The power of the crawler. Keep him rolling. Uh, he might have just took my bait. Because he did. Probably should have put these crawlers in a cooler, but... You know, sometimes you get in a hurry. At least I know I do. I think I got all the big ones out of the hot pocket. At least all the big active big ones. Oh, there's so much gunk out there. Still gonna send it. Anybody out there? Yep, on to the second pond. It's like a little pocket there. A new hot pocket? We will see. I'm in the hot pocket. Or just the pocket currently. We don't know if it's hot yet. It is not hot. Oh, there went something big. Big bass. Gotta be. Turning around these rocks. Oh, getting bit. Let Big Dad take it. Yep, perfect. What are you doing up in that shallow stuff, man? I ain't complaining. You're just in sunfish country. Keep her moving. Poking, prodding, prospecting. All that good stuff. Terrible cast. Well, I think there's a big, big old largemouth out there. Maybe it's a catfish. I don't know. It's a large fish of some sort. I'm going to try and cast at it. Oh, he turned on it. So far he hasn't eaten it. We're in the weeds. Put a big old chunk of crawler on there. See if that gets his attention. Big chunk of crawler is relative. We're still bait fishing. I give up on you. It's a real dumb bass. Get it. Just gonna make a walk around the whole pond. <clears throat> see what I see. So this is an actual opening in the weeds. No. It's like a little hole. Like a muskrat hole or something. Is anything living in it? A little guy lives by it. Oh, he's so tiny. Oh, here come the bigger ones. Eat it. Just come in and finish the deed. Oh, he's still not even that big. <laughs> I just watched a bluegill run into another bluegill. That was kind of entertaining. Well, they didn't like when I lifted the bait out of the water. Oh, getting nibbed. Got him. Big enough. Add him to the pile. How's everybody looking? Okay. Don't have enough room to add a ton more. We can add a few. Oh, well, now they're all right in front of me. Not, not overly impressed by the size of the gills here. I'm gonna use gills, I like big ones. Kind of a bluegill schnob. Green sunfish, I'll take them all. Stuff moving up here. It almost looks like a green sunfish. Almost. How can there be a pond without green sunfish in it? It's like an American. Oh, there's something. You'll work. You know what the best catfish bait in the world is? Whatever you can get. Turns out today it's bluegills. Oh, there's a bluegill immediately staring at my bobber, but not my bait. 
The bobber's not edible, bro. There's something over there. Whiff. Oh, didn't see that frog. Would not be surprised a bit if there's some giant largemouth in here. So it just looks like there aren't weeds, but there are. They're just an inch below the surface. If there's greenies, they're gonna be around here for sure. It's the world's smallest green sunfish, maybe. Or might be a bluegill. The fact they bolted makes me think they're green sun or they're bluegills. Green sunfish have Napoleon syndrome. There we go. Ooh, that's a nice gill. Oh, that's a hybrid. Oh, so that means there are some green sunfish in here. That's a bomb bait, in case anyone's wondering. Yep, that's a hybrid bluegill green sunfish mix. Old Denny Halgren's favorite, is my understanding. Denny Halgren is a legend, like one of the innovators of daytime flyhead fishing. Be sweet to catch another one or ten of those. Oh, there's some bluegills. Be sure they're bluegills. Yep, skittish like bluegills. Anybody home here? Like it when like an eight inch green sunfish would just jet out. Doesn't look like it's gonna happen there. Oh, you'll work. I like instant. It's the thing with catching bait. Can't take forever. Otherwise it cuts into your fishing time. Sometimes you gotta look for new bait spots, like what I'm doing now. Or you just buy it, I guess. Get the best bait you can't buy in my opinion and we still haven't caught the best bait but we'll keep looking Ooh. that's nice I think we got room for one more if I can get them quick got them quick guess it's time to get it Chorn's Chorn, over for the day. I'm gonna keep prospecting and looking for new places and hopefully I find some real bangers. But I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the like button. If you wanna see more, hit the subscribe button. If you wanna check out my podcast, that's linked in the description. And otherwise, just thanks for taking time to watch. It means a ton. Hope you catch a giant.